I was um, engaged. <laughs> wow, okay. London originally. Yeah, I've been here since October. Skill. Okay, born 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 in okay. Okay. Cute boy. Like finally. Where are you from? Born and raised in Penang, moved to KL about 10 years ago. And then I went to France for two years okay. and then I moved back about nine months ago. My first impression of Luciana was she is uh, really cute, really pretty. She looked really confident. She didn't look phased at all by being under the lights. Okay, to be honest, when they told me I was seeing someone that is a Westerner, I thought I was gonna meet like a Viking person. But then when I met him, I was taken aback because that's not what I uh, imagined. Have you been on a blind date before? No, it's my first time. Oh, good. How are you gonna feeling? We're gonna go through this together then. How about yeah. how are you feeling? How am I feeling? Yeah. I'm feeling uh, yeah, quite, uh, quite chill, relaxed. Uh, uh, I wouldn't say I'm nervous, but Maybe, I don't know. My first impression of her was that, you know, she's this drop dead gorgeous Ashwara Rai looking girl sitting there and I'm like, yo, salam alaikum, you know. <laughs> but yeah, like, uh, honestly, uh, she's got good vibes. Uh, very hard to come by sometimes. What dogs you have? I'm Russell and a Shih Tzu. And I have their babies as well, so there's like four of them at home. So they're jack <laughs> 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 Yes. Yep. 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 Jack <laughs> shit. Yeah, that's the first time I've heard that, but yep. Yeah. So what is it that you do? Photographer. Okay. I actually have my own company. We do a lot of um, social tech uh, venture related uh, projects. Okay. What about other stuff I had in mind? I actually wanted to be a producer or a singer. Ah, so you can sing then. I was uh, just about to ask you to sing okay. me a song on our first date. You want me to sing a song on yeah. your first day? Yeah, what is your favorite song? Sing me a song. I will sing you uh, Who Spent Times oh, by Engelbert Humperdinck. Alright. You too. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, blue Spanish eyes. Teardrops are falling from your Spanish eyes. Okay. I do. I work for a record label and a recording studio. Okay. So what do you do now? Now I work with a company called Influasia. I'm not too sure if you've heard of World of Us. Of course. Yeah. Who hasn't? So I handle their accounts. So basically business development thing. I don't know. I'm not too sure. <gasps> <laughs> Wow. It's a living creature. Somebody please help. This, this might go in your direction, I'm sorry. It's turning, it's just walking in circles. Okay. Thank you for Rescued. that. Rescued. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> that was unexpected. Oh, okay. <laughs> I recently moved here to to Malaysia. All right. So I've only been here four months or so. Okay. I didn't know if I was going to stay here. All right. So I haven't really kind of sought to get into a relationship at the moment. I would just say we were too young. We met while she was in high school. Then when we grew up, 
things change, just things didn't work out and we ended it sort of mutually, sort of. Why no girlfriends within this four years? Hard time getting over. Yeah. Wow, <laughs> brutal honesty right there. The moment he said that he's been single for four years because he couldn't get over his ex. I mean, four years is a really long time. How about you? Um, one year? Yeah, one year. I was um, engaged. <laughs> wow, okay. When people want different things in life, you just need to know where to compromise. And if you can't compromise, then I guess that's the end of a story. Should we begin? Yes. I'm gonna be as graceful as I can doing this. It's so chunky. Yes. Mm. <laughs> chunky. <laughs> Oh, oh, no. <laughs> Help. oh well. <laughs> oh god. Thank you. Oh god. Thank you. Oh god. What a doctor. What do you think about marriage? Marriage? Is a beautiful thing. That's what I think. I mean, for me, I would love to get married. But there's a lot of divorce cases lately. Oh, yeah. A good friend of mine, uh, his parents, they've been together for years, like 50 years or something. You know, had several kids, never wanted to get married, never needed to get married. Right. They're still very much in love with each other, raised the family, but didn't need to get, to, married. To get married to do it. Yeah. So I quite like that idea as well. I believe that he has his own set of beliefs and values of what he has learned throughout his experience and how he has been brought up. But I truly believe that if you love someone and you know this is the one for you, the only way to show your commitment and to show your love is to ask her or his hand in marriage. I'm not, maybe I came across as I was like very anti-marriage, but that's not the case. I'm just like, I'm not massively into the idea of like, big kind of celebration marriage I kind of think you know if you're kind of if you're in love with a the person then you want to get married you don't necessarily need the big ceremony you can just you have one another that's all you need I feel like in the 21st century in, in, in our in our era people don't understand the importance of marriage so it's more of like okay we'll get married and then if it doesn't work out I'm not gonna work things out with you I'll just you know find another person place what I had with you yeah and I feel like that's not how it should be you make a vow you take a vow with someone and I believe that you see it through until yeah. the end that's how I feel about marriage it's something sacred it's something that I want to have with someone yeah 100% agree could I have said it better myself <laughs> pretty much so all right well at least we're on the same page when it comes to marriage Right. <laughs> As a first date, it's first dates are kind of a little bit stressful anyway because of what you're walking into. But to walk into one uh, under camera and under lights, that adds a different level of uh, of pressure. Maybe it wasn't the best reflection of me uh, on a first date, but that's okay. So in terms of uh, doing this whole blind date, especially with Jamie, I felt it was an eye opener because you don't know what you're going to meet or who you're going to meet or what are you going to get out of that person. Overall, it has been something that I truly enjoyed. Uh, I was never expecting someone like her. I think I am myself. I don't know if I overstepped or, or stayed reserved, but yeah, like uh, yeah, it's been a great uh, pleasure for being part of this uh, blind date experiment. The moment we met, we felt like there was um, some sort of connection. I had a really good conversation. I felt like I got to know him better. So, you know, overall, I would say it was great. I think it was actually a great time. I had a really great time. But yeah, like, she's a cool person, vibe. But yeah, it's cool. In general, he is someone that I might 
consider to date but because of his past I would say it is something that I might not be inclined to pursue yeah all right so the million dollar question would you guys go on a second date I'll, you know what? I'll let you answer that first. Ooh, second date? That should be a billion dollar question because I would say yes. Oh. But, uh, I like how you're very confident. Uh, your laugh is very contagious. <laughs> uh, once it's contagious, it's just a contagion, you know what I mean? <laughs> okay, so what do you think, Ishana? Mm. Like, would I go out with him again? Yeah, I would. I would. Yeah, it's a, I would say yes. It's a yes for me. Um, I would say yes as well because I felt like uh, I could get to know you better okay. without the cameras and you know just uh, yeah, sure. people around just getting yep. to know what you like what you yep. like to do mm -hmm. yeah so I would say yes okay. great uh, maybe not a date like we can hang out yeah yeah down for that yeah yeah maybe not a date but we would definitely hang out as friends and you know get to know each other more down and for that. yeah yeah, yeah. To get a drink? Yeah, why not? Okay, I would love that. Let's go. See ya! Bye! Bye! <laughs> <laughs> so, peace out, homie. <laughs>